Hello my students, how are you? Great for today we will solve weekly assessment number 15. Model A choose the correct answer number 1 when dividing 834 by 3 the quotient will be between 200 and 300 why look at here 8 divided by 3 equal 2 and the remainder 2 23 divided by 3 equals 7 and the remainder 2 24 divided by 3 equal 8 then 278 lies between 200 and 300 you can solve by this method or another method by your mind look at here this number 800 34 divided by 3 you can solve in one step about the approximating this number 800 34 approximating to the nearest 100 this number we can say the next number can divide it by 3 equal 900 900 divided by 3 equal 300 then the answer lies between 200 and 300 200 and 300 okay you can solve by this method or other as you like next question 2 plus 4 times 6 we can find the answer here it's order operation to find the answer first division and multiplication and next step addition and subtraction from left hand side right hand side right 2 plus 4 times 6 is 24 2 plus 24 is 26 since answer here would be 26 4 times 6 24 then 24 plus 2 equal 26 choose letter a next question find the result 15 divided by 5 plus 4 minus 1 it's also order operation first operation here division and then addition and next subtract 15 divided by 5 equal 3 3 plus 4 minus 1 3 plus 4 is 7 7 minus 1 equal 6 next question find the result number 4 8 times 2 plus 24 subtract by 12 first operation here multiplication 2 times 8 16 and 24 subtract by 12 16 plus 24 subtract by 12 4 plus 6 10 0 and the carry up 1 3 plus 1 4 then 40 minus 12 0 minus 2 we can't do it 10 minus 2 equal 8 and 3 minus 1 equal 2 the result will be 28 28 next question number 5 Abdullah likes collecting stamps and has obtained 244 241 stamps he keeps 25 stamps and won't distribute the remaining ones equally among six of his friends how many stamps will each friend get? first step we have 241 and he keeps with him 25 and he wants to divide it the remainder by six of his friends we won't find the number of stamps will each friend get we can find the difference here 1 minus 5 you can do it by 1 it will be 11 11 minus 5 equals 6 and 3 minus 2 equal 1 and then group 2 divided by 6 2 divided by 6 we can do it 21 divided by 6 we can write 3 3 times 6 equal 18 18 just after 18 19 20 21 then 36 divided by 6 equals 6 Okay, 241 subtract by 25 divided by 6. 11 minus 5 equals 6 and 3 minus 2, 1. 216 divided by 6. 21 divided by 6 equals 3 and the remainder 3. 36 divided by 6 equals 6. And each one will take the number of stamps. What will be when dividing 346 by 5? The question will be between what and what we can write. The dividend 346 divided by 5 look at here we have remainder this example he asked about the remainder or the quotient lies between what and what 346 series 2 300 is less than okay and 346 lies between 300 and 400 you can divide it 300 by 5 
because this number can divide by nine by five. A number has zero or five is a ones can divide by five. Seventeen divided by five equals six, and zero divided by five equals zero. Three divided by five can do it. Thirty-four divided by five equals six, and remainder, what we have remainder here, remainder four. Forty-six divided by five equals nine, and the remainder one. Then this number lies between sixty and what you can choose one or here sixty and seventeen. This number forty divided by five equal eight and raise zero. Then with the answer will be sixty nine and the middle one lies between sixty and seventy. This number sixty nine and the remainder one. Okay, so the answer will be what sixty and seventy. Okay, the answer will be sixty and seventy. Choose here sixty. Look at here sixty and seventy. So you can find the answer by your mind, 346 Approximately there is 100, it will be 300 divided by 5 equals 60 Next question Times 3 Plus 6 3 times 8 is 24, 24 plus 6 equals 30 next question find the result 7 plus 20 divided by 10 minus 2 7 plus 70 divided by 10 equals 7 and 7 plus 7 14 14 minus 2 equal 12 it's so order operation division first 70 divided by 10 7, 7 plus 7, 14 minus 2 equal 12. Next example 99 minus 10 times 9 plus 7. First operation here multiplication. All right, 10 times 9 is 90, then 99 subtract by 90 plus 7. 99 minus 9 is 9. 9 plus 7 equal 16. Next question, number 5. May have walked 14 kilometers for two weeks, and it's the third week she walked at a distance of 5 kilometers. How many kilometers did she walk during those three walked in meters? We can collect together 14 kilometers at two weeks. And the third week she walked 5 km. Then 14 plus 5. We can collect 14 plus 5. Because he need here the distance that she walked during those 3 walks in meters. We can collect 14 and 5. The total distance will be 19 km. Next question. When dividing 562 by 8, the quotient will be between what and what? We have 562 divided by 8. We know 56 divided by 8 equals 7. And 2 divided by 8, 0, and the remainder 2. And the result here lies between 70 and 80. Lies between 70 and 80. The number lies between 70 and 80. Okay. You know or not again? This number 562. The last number like this 560 can divide by 8. 56 divided by 7 and then write 0. The result will be 70. Lies between 70 and 80. Choose that way. Next question. Number 2. 4 plus 8 divided by 2. Write 4 and 8 divided by 2 equal 4. 4 plus 4 equal 8. So the following 49 subtract by 7 multiply by 6 plus 4. Write 49 subtract by 6 times 7 is 42. We can find the difference. 49 minus 42 is 7. 7 e to 4 
the result will be 11 next question find the result 12 minus 72 divided by 12 plus 2 write 12 subtract by 72 divided by 12 equals 6 plus 2 12 minus 6 is 6 6 plus 2 equal 8 this is the answer here will be 8 next question number 5 there are 107 people as a concert after the concert 43 people left in cars the remaining people want to return home using microbus the capacity of each microbus is 9 people how many microbus are need to get everyone home okay first step we have the total number 187 people we have number of people going by the car when the finished uh, party finished 47 going by the car okay and the remainder people want to return home using microbus then we can find the difference first and divided by what we know any microbus contains of nine people only then the remainder we can divide it by nine to find the number of bus we need okay microbus need how many microbus we need we can find the, the result divided by nine because 443 people lived in cars lived in home by cars by the remaining can divide it by nine the remaining people want to return home using microbus okay then we can find the result 7 minus 3 equal 4 8 minus 4 equal 4 and then divided by 9 14 divided by 9 equal 1 1 times 9 equal 9 9 plus 5 is 14 and then 45 divided by 9 45 divided by 9 equals 6 okay then the answer will be 16 microbus we need 16 microbus you know microbus okay again we have 43 people going at home by using a car but the remainder need going to the home using microbus if the capacity of each microbus is nine people how many microbus are need to get everyone home we can find 444 divided by nine the result will be 16 microbus and that's what it's important question general revision next time i will explain it okay goodbye